24 hours to election day. <laughs> this is that. it. I remember Everybody's those days. putting everything together. This is all they got. Let's tell folks a little bit about what's going on behind the scenes. Well, you've been, you've been preparing from the moment you announced your candidacy for this moment, and you have no control over what is happening in the moment. So hopefully you've built the networks, you've raised the money, your strategic plan, your polling, all of these things have been synchronized to deliver the results that you're hoping for literally in hours to come. Uh, although I would disagree with you a little bit. I think you actually have a lot of control. This may be a little bit different between Democrats and Republicans, but on the Democratic side, they're making phone calls, they're knocking on doors, they're they're doing what we call knock and drags, which is you try to get people to come to the polls and vote, because that's a really important part. You know, a great story on the Democratic side is when Bill Bradley ran against um, Al Gore, in New Hampshire, mm -hmm. on that race, exit polls had Bill Bradley winning in the morning. Al Gore turned up his operation and he won that night. Well, you know, the people who vote in primaries tend to be more passionate voters. They're committed to going to vote on June 10th, which whether doesn't matter whether it's a nice day or not, they're going to the polls. But I, I would submit to you there's another influence on the primary elections. People in some locations around the state they're going to go vote because of a local referendum or yeah. a candidate for town council. That person is going to bring some people to the polls who, while they're in there voting, yeah. they might as well vote for the congressional candidate as well. You know the moment that I actually always love the best on election day? It's right at 8 o'clock to about 9 o'clock at night. 8 o'clock, all the polls have closed. There's nothing else you can do about it. All the returns are still being counted. You have no idea if you've won or lost and you're just kind of in this silent space. I always, I'm always out at a poll, so I'm usually driving back, and it's a real quiet sort of passive time. My, my most favorite. favorite time in that process is when the opponent calls and says congratulations. <laughs> Fair enough.